We are here outside of our Airbnb and we just made a trip to Costco and we get a lot of our supplies from Costco for our Airbnb. A lot of the consumables, a lot of the cleaning products that we use. So we just wanted to make a video showing you the items that we use from Costco for our Airbnb. For all of you that know, Costco does a lot of bulk wholesale items. And so for us as hosts, it makes it easy to stock up on our consumables for our Airbnb. Yeah, come on in. So we're gonna start behind the scenes <laughs> in our Airbnb. So we have a external laundry room. So we have an in-unit laundry room inside the Airbnb, but then we also have this one that's that's outside. Um, I guess don't have access to it, but our cleaners do. So we keep all of our bulk cleaning products in there. So a couple of Costco items that we have in here, laundry detergent. So we choose to get the free and clear for our guests just to avoid any issues that guests might have if they have allergies or anything like that it's just good to use a laundry soap that's fragrance free and that's not going to be irritating to guests so we have that bleach to we have all white sheets so we can and towels so we can use bleach on everything it helps just keep things white get out any stains and also you know, kills bacteria just as good for to keep, keep things clean right inside of our airbnb we have a closet that's designated for all of our supplies and all of our linens also so we keep this locked for the cleaners so the cleaners have access to it so this is locked when guests are here but inside we have all our linens and the rest of our cleaning products and restocking supplies and all of that so the big ticket items that we get from costco towels we'll show you these in the bathroom also but we have all of our towels paper towels toilet paper we have kitchen towels that we purchased from costco and we have all of our restocking kitchen supplies hand soaps we have body washes shampoos and everything so we keep all of those supplies here so then we can just refill them as we need to out for the guests in the airbnb a lot of things in here we do get from Costco's. All our linens we got on Amazon. We'll do a different video for that. This is a dehumidifier that we got from Costco. And I actually was looking at one when we were going to buy one at Home Depot. And they were a much better deal at Costco for the size that this dehumidifier is. So I think us being in Louisiana, sometimes it just gets a little humid in here. So having a dehumidifier, especially for the summer months, is really great. So that's something that we purchased from Costco also. One of the things that we love to get from Costco are their rugs. They're really great quality and they're reasonably priced. These are indoor outdoor rugs and we find that those are very durable for guests. So, and I think that this one maybe cost around 80 to $90 for this size of a rug. These runner rugs that we got from Costco, they're about like $15 a piece. We think they're a great buy. So the next item that we purchased from Costco is our TV. So this one is a 43 inch ultra high def uh, smart TV from Hisense. And the benefit of having these smart TVs is they feature this thing called guest mode. So your guests, they can kind of log in with their own streaming service login and they can kind of state what days they check in, check out, and it'll automatically um, sign them out upon their departure. So it's a super easy feature to have for uh, the guests so that way they're not sharing account passwords with other repeat guests or whatnot. Um, and the benefit from buying TVs from Costco is um, just two to five year added warranty, any sort of service. And usually they have very comparable prices to say like Amazon for whatever reason. So um, yeah, just getting our smart TVs from Costco. So the internet that we provide for our guests is done with uh, a Google mesh network. So what we do is we connect the Google um, hubs to our main network and then it's sort of an independent and separate network that is connected so that way the guests can just log on there we give them their Wi-Fi code um, and that way you know they don't interfere with sort of our personal uh, Wi-Fi as well and the great thing about the mesh network is you can purchase these Google nodes essentially which helps amplify your uh, network 
allowing you to reach to maybe some of the either more uh, remote or distant places that you have in your property and they can get Wi-Fi in all areas of your property. So moving on to the kitchen, we give our guests water bottles. Normally we have eight in here. Um, we just have two right now, we need to fill it up, but it's cheap to get at Costco, just a, a bag of water and the guests really like it. It's just an added thing that you can do as a host. So we get water from Costco and we just throw it in the fridge for them. Um, moving on to some of the kitchen supplies that we give them. So these sponges, we always give them a sponge, um, disinfecting wipes, a little dish soap, and some dishwasher pods. So the dishwasher pods and the sponges we get at Costco, and these disinfecting wipes you can also get at Costco as well. And then these we just ordered off of Amazon. So those things we include for the guests. We always put out paper towels for our guests, and then we always include an extra roll for them. And then moving on to the coffee. So we provide a coffee and tea for our guests. Um, we normally, so we did get just community coffee um, brand at Costco. It's a, it's a popular brand in Louisiana. So we, we were sending this out for our guests, which is a coffee maker, but you know, Costco always gets us with the deals. So we ended up actually getting a Keurig to replace the existing coffee pot. This was originally, we paid $100 for it. And it was originally $150. And so they were had a sale for $99. So we just ended up getting it just this weekend. So we're gonna look to transition this um, to replace our existing coffee pot that we have. We provide our guests with basic cooking items. So we have this, these spices that we got from Costco. It looks like the guests have used a fair amount of some of them, like the garlic powder and the red pepper flakes are really popular. But you can get this at Costco, it looks nice. You can actually, it comes with like a lifetime supply of the spices, so you can order more. I think you do just have to pay for shipping. But we, so we include just the basic spices. We also include just avocado cooking spray. We provide this for our guests. And then we also provide them with salt and pepper. So we just get the bulk salt and peppers and then we just refill them as the guests use them. And that all comes from Costco. So moving on to the bathroom, some of the other items that we purchased from Costco are gonna be your wash, uh, washcloths, hand towels, as well as um, just normal bath towels, as well as, you know, also the toilet paper. Within the shower though, we have this mounted shampoo, your conditioner, your body wash, all of which um, we just get in bulk at Costco, and then when um, our cleaning team comes in and notices that, hey, you know, one of these is low, they just know in the cleaning closet where we have the uh, refillables, so they can just fill it up, and it's very easy. We purchased this set from Amazon, but the actual liquids um, we just get at Costco. This is our outdoor patio. So the items that we get from Costco here are, we bought these string lights, and they're actually run off the solar, so we don't have to have them plugged in and we never had to worry about them being charged up so we just have two solar lights it was enough we had to buy two packs to cover our porch but we also keep right here this is the button to turn them on and off and it just adds a little bit more light to our outdoor space and then the other kind of tech product that we got at costco right you can get at costco or <laughs> <laughs> Or any sort of security cameras. So we do have security cameras on the outside in the back of the front of the property. These are disclosed to guests that we have them. But it's just a way to kind of monitor um, any sort of security that you, you know, security for your property. So those items you can also purchase at Costco. 